right, so long, long time ago when Adam was in the garden, man, he was strolling around that garden and looking at things and hanging out with the goats and the animals, the apes and everything else that was in there, man. And, and God looked down at creation and he saw that man was alone. And for the very first time in all the creation, he said, man, it's, it's not good that man be alone. It, he didn't could find anything to be a partner with him. And so he put him to sleep. And, uh, and he took out a rib and he fastened a woman. And uh, actually, Adam actually named her, the Bible says. And so it says he looked at her and, and he named her, whoa, man. <laughs> Jess? Yes. You look beautiful today. No one will deny that. Cohen? Get out of the way, I'm talking to Jess. <laughs> Cohen, you're more than just a friend to me. You're a friend, a hunting buddy, a fishing buddy, a helping hand without a second thought, a shoulder to cry on, and a brother. I've seen this day coming a lot longer than most have. When suddenly, dear Leary's conversations and activities turn from <laughs> calling cats and foxes, sometimes dinosaurs. <laughs> talking about how crazy you are about this girl right here. Yep. Jess has changed you in a lot of ways and this world would be much better off with a few people who had half the heart you had. <laughs> Jess, there's no question what Colin sees in you. You've got eyes and a smile that are right up a room. And you're a caring and fun loving, unlike anyone I've ever met. That's what I appreciate about you. <laughs> That's what I appreciate about you, honey. <laughs> I truly believe the two of you make each other want to be better people, for, both for themselves and for each other. What you found is rare. And I don't think there's anyone on this earth that deserves it more than the two of you. That being said, I love y'all with all my heart. I wish you nothing but the best. And I'd like to raise a toast <laughs> to Mr. and Mrs. Caruth. So they are no longer two, but one. What therefore God has joined together, let no man separate. For the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Colin Caruth. Get out of me. Oh my god. Yeah. Did anybody see my Woo! Yeah, I got it. Did you really?
Uh, the first thing she said to me, we met at a softball game, and she said, Hey, do you like wine? Okay, me, me too. So we're doing this. And, um, I don't know, the rest is kind of history. Uh, if you know Jessie, she's a one-of-a-kind person. She's beautiful inside out. Um, very crazy and unique in her own way. And Cohen, I feel is, I feel like you compliment her so well because you're so much more together. <laughs> Sorry, pretty good. Um, but I'm so happy for you guys. Um, I think the world of y'all and I wish y'all a world of happiness. And now Holly's gonna talk because I'm done. Okay. Uh, anybody that knows me knows I don't like to talk in front of a lot of people, but that's okay because I'm doing it for you too. Yeah. Okay, so I've known this one for about uh, 24 years, you know, since she was born. She's an awesome little sister that I would do anything for, you know threatened to fight guys that picked on her. Even though I'm little, I'm pretty tough, Colin. She's pretty sweet. Um, so, <laughs> so um, I wish you guys nothing but the best, Jess. You know, you, you deserve all the happiness in the world because I've seen you go through so much with bad guys. And I told you, when you said, I'm going on a date, I'm so nervous. I said, you need to go, like, for real. She's like, I don't know. And I'm like, no, really. You need to go. And then she showed me a picture. And then if you know Jesse, you can't be like, oh my God, I'm so excited for you. Cause then she gets scared. Like, like this is gonna happen. Cause it, it just happened, you know? So I was like, oh, that's awesome. I hope he's a really nice guy. And I tell Alex, oh my gosh, you know, I think she's gonna marry him. She's gonna marry him. And what happened? I was right again. <laughs> no, but um, Colin, I'm so glad that you are a part of our family. Cause you're one of the few guys that would get in the floor with my boys and play cars for hours. I mean, you are a very, you're a great uncle. Those kids look up to you and they like worship the ground you walk on because you are Uncle Colin to them and you are awesome. But they love you to death. And one little girl is super excited for you guys that you got married. You know, she wears her heart on her sleeve like her Aunt Jessie. They're much alike. Um, but I'm so excited for the both of you. <laughs> uh, you guys, like I said, like Huff said and Yvonne said, you guys deserve all the happiness in the world because you guys are perfect for each other. You compliment each other. Colin does whatever Jessie says, which is perfect because she needs somebody just like that. <laughs> They're going to end up living on a farm with tons of animals because Colin can't say no to Jesse. <laughs> so I just want to raise a toast to you guys to many more years of happiness and, and also a thank you to all of you for being here and just loving them so much to be here to celebrate this special day with them and we cannot thank you guys enough, everybody, for being here and helping out. So God bless you, God bless you guys and here's to Colin and Jesse. Father, we just honor you. You did a great job when you invented marriage. And Father, we're just excited for Colin and Jesse. We just pray that their marriage will last a lifetime. Yeah, their home will be filled with love and joy, hope, with peace and laughter and fun. And we just pray, God, today that you seal their love for one another and their commitment to each other and to you. And God, this 65 years from now, they'll be sitting on a porch somewhere drinking iced tea. God, just enjoying life and thinking how awesome it's been. And so we just put them in your hands. We put this time in your hands. Grace us with your presence. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.
I'm super happy for you, man. I'm pumped. You've waited a long time for this. You deserve it. Happy for you. Love you. Okay. Hey, Cullen, just want to congratulate you on your wedding and your marriage. I uh, hope you and Jess have a long, full life of joy. Little ones, everything like that. A bunch of hunting adventures. I know we've uh, known each other for a while, and uh, you get pretty shy around girls, but you... You, you light up pretty good around this one, and I hope it works. Well, I know it'll work out. I hope it worked out to begin with, but y'all are going to be happy. Uh, soak all this in. I know you were nervous before. Shed some tears, but that's good. That's that's part of it. That's part of, you know, growing up and realizing what you got. So I just go on and congratulate y'all again and love y'all. Appreciate you guys for letting me be a part of your big day. I wish y'all nothing but happiness and love. Love both of y'all. That's it? That's it. All right, uh, Colin and Jess, I'm glad to be here for your wedding. Um, I'll talk about what I know, and like Colin tries to play it tough all the time, and he is the softest dude I've ever met in my life. So, I mean, Jess, if you get ticked off at him, there's probably half of what he's actually talking about. He actually, like, you know, cares about you and all that stuff, so take it easy on him. And why is my name being called that now? But anyway, good luck. <laughs> Ready? I'm going to be the encouraging one. Um, marriage is hard work. I mean, every day you got to decide to put effort into it. So I just hope the best for y'all. Uh, when things get tough, just really focus on the other person, not yourself. And, uh, it usually ends up working out. So love you guys. Best of luck. Thanks. Uh, to my baby sister, I love you so much. I'm happy to be a part of your day. Always remember who is here to love on you and support you through all this. Uh, we are here if you ever need anything. A place to go, whatever. Always remember, never go to bed mad at each other. Uh, always solve the problem and always give it to God. Love you both. Hit it. Jesse, Cullen, so happy for you guys. Um, thank you for letting me be a part of your special day. Uh, just love y'all so much. And excited for what the future holds for you guys. Um, I know I'm not far into it, but marriage is uh, its tough. But as long as you have the person that you love by you um, through whatever, you can get through whatever. So just remember that and stay close to Jesus. Love you guys. OK. Hey, Jess. Um, Congratulations, I'm so happy for y'all. I'm so glad to have met you. Um, I knew you'd find the one, we've talked about it before and I kept telling you, you would find the one. Colin's perfect for you. And I wish you both the best and as long as you put God in the middle, everything will be perfect. Love you. Hi Jess, thank you for letting me be a part of your day. I know we haven't known each other long, but you're one of a kind soul. I wish you guys nothing but the best. Marriage is hard, and y'all are gonna get on each other's nerves. But in the end, there's nothing better, and I'm so glad you found the one that you're gonna spend forever with. Bye. Look in the camera and say it. I love you, Jess. There you go. Yes. <laughs>